Mexico is known for its wonderful city life, rich culture, breathtaking beaches, and gorgeous natural wonders. But as beautiful as Mexico is, there are some parts of it that are best visited with caution. From gang violence to corruption, these unsavory places have various dangers that visitors should be aware of. In today's video, we'll be looking at the places you should avoid at all costs when you're visiting Mexico. Be sure to watch till the end so you can avoid accidentally going to one of these locations. Without further ado, let's dive right in with our first entry. Ciudad Juarez Ciudad Juarez is a city located near an international border crossing. This means that cartel activity here is pretty strong. The Juarez cartel has a stronghold in the city, and they're not hesitant to dismember and throw the bodies of rival gang members in public places. In Ciudad Juarez, smuggling is a common criminal activity. The cartel is also involved in drug smuggling. All this makes Ciudad Juarez a pretty dangerous place to visit as a tourist. On top of all that, Ciudad Juarez doesn't have many tourist attractions either, making it not at all worth putting yourself in danger for. Celaya In the entirety of Mexico, Celaya is one of the most corrupt states. You'll see corruption everywhere, from officials taking bribery to people trying to scam unaware tourists out of their money. Additionally, Celaya is also plagued by the Santa Rosa de Lima cartel. The cartel is very powerful in the city, and bloodshed is rampant due to this. It is pretty common for there to be shootouts between the police and the cartel, resulting in casualties. Sometimes, civilians and tourists can also get caught in the conflict. So, even if you are enticed by the wonderful architecture of Celaya, it's best not to step foot there until it becomes a safer place. Uruapan Uruapan is an economic powerhouse in Mexico, as well as the second largest city in the Mexican state of Michoacán. Unfortunately, Uruapan is also a cartel capital, so cartel wars and police skirmishes with the cartels are rampant. Although the city used to be safer in the past, nowadays, cartel activities have increased quite a bit, so tourists are better off staying away for their own safety. If you must visit, be sure to be wary of anyone acting suspiciously. Culiacán Culiacán is a city that tourists should avoid at all costs since it is home to some of the most notorious cartels in Mexico. Shootouts between different cartels happen pretty often out on the streets. Although the casualties are usually limited to cartel members involved in the fight, it's not unheard of for a nearby civilian to get hurt because of a stray or intentionally fired bullet. Culiacán also has a pretty high crime index score, making it even less tourism friendly. For anyone valuing their safety, Culiacán should not be a city on your list of cities to visit in Mexico. Cancún Although Cancún does not have the same cartel problems as some of the other entries in this video, it does have a pretty big crime problem. Robbery and theft have become a major problem for tourism recently in this city. This is because Cancún has been a tourism hotspot for a long time. Now, due to this popularity and abundance of tourists walking around absentmindedly, pickpockets and muggings are very profitable for local criminals. According to the United States Travel Advisory Board, criminal activities may occur in Cancun at any place at any time. So if you intend to visit this city with sandy beaches, blue sea, and Mayan heritage, you will need to be on full alert at all times. Solo adventuring is even more dangerous. For maximum security, you should stay within the property of the resort you're staying at. This way, you'll also be able to avoid most of the corruption plaguing Cancun. Irapuato Located in the Guanajuato state, Irapuato is considered a gem of the central area of Mexico. It's located between two rivers, and it's called the world's strawberry capital. But despite its unique views and rich history, Irapuato is not a safe place to be as a tourist. Crime in this city has been on the rise for a long time due to disagreements between different gangs about territory. Although shootouts can happen, there are other criminal activities underway in the city as well. Tourists can end up being a victim of fuel theft, kidnapping, and extortion. It's better not to visit Irapuato at all, but if you must, stay in the safer tourist area at all times. Guadalajara Guadalajara holds a lot of cultural significance for tourists visiting Mexico. This is why it's a shame that it's such a dangerous place to be if you're not careful. Guadalajara has a pretty big car theft problem. Public transportation isn't very safe either. Armed robbery of public buses is a possible occurrence during your visit, so it's best to stick with registered taxi services. But the worst thing about Guadalajara is probably the pickpocketing and mugging risks. Pickpocketing operators are everywhere, from public transport to tourist areas. 
During the night, mugging becomes an ever-present threat as well. Worst of all, most tourist areas are filled with scam artists ready to take advantage of any gullible tourists they can find. Coatzacoalcos Located in the state of Veracruz, Coatzacoalcos is another gorgeous place that you should not visit during your stay in Mexico. With the scenic beach areas and the tons of tourist attractions, this city has sadly become home to a lot of organized crime and the dangers associated with that as well. It's gotten so bad that even the locals don't feel safe anymore in Coatzacoalcos. So as a tourist, you're worse off as you'll be targeted by pickpockets and others trying to rob you. The resort properties are mostly safe, but outside of that, you'll be putting yourself in danger. Cuernavaca Cuernavaca has its fair share of crime, but the more pressing danger in this city is natural disasters. Cuernavaca is located right inside one of the world's most seismologically active regions. This means that the city often experiences earthquakes. These earthquakes can be hard to predict, so there isn't much caution you can take to protect yourself during a visit. This is why most tourists instead decide to avoid Cuernavaca altogether to ensure their safety. Acapulco Acapulco used to be a popular tourist destination. It was even called the Riviera of Mexico. But the reputation of this city has fallen quite a bit in the last few years, due to organized crime syndicates moving in. The crime in the area has gotten so bad that the United States Advisory issued a Do Not Travel Level 4 status to the whole state of Guerrero, in which Acapulco is located. This is the same level that was given to Syria, Iraq, and Afghanistan. Tourist kidnapping is a constant threat, and these kidnappings can often turn deadly. Plus, violent crimes such as armed robberies are an ever-looming possibility each time you leave your resort. Until Acapulco is made safer one way or the other, it's best to just avoid visiting it. Tijuana Tijuana is an emerging tourist hotspot with various museums and markets for visitors to explore. However, it's also one of the most dangerous places in Mexico to be a tourist. Not only that, but it is considered the most violent city in the entire world. It has one of the highest ratios of murders per resident. This is due to the thriving drug trade in the city. There are various crimes that can impact tourists associated with the drug trade and organized crime. Gang wars, corruption, and violence are pretty commonplace in Tijuana. The scariest crime for tourists is the kidnapping of foreign visitors for ransom and bribes. This is especially true if you try to go to the more remote locations of the city. Pickpocketing, mugging, and scams are all fairly common in Tijuana. On top of that, this city is especially dangerous for female visitors due to the high harassment risk on the streets. Overall, Tijuana is a place that you, as a tourist, should avoid visiting. Hopefully, by knowing which places to avoid, you can have a happy trip to Mexico with no dangers coming your way. For more traveling and tourist videos like these, be sure to like and subscribe. Until next time, safe travels!